Hi friends, Clark here, and if you're new to rolling joints or if you just wanna compare your technique to mine, then this video is for you. But before we dive into the rolling, let's go over what we're gonna be smoking on. Eighth here of Cookies Peach Punch. Cookies is a really popular California brand. It started outside of San Francisco, but it has now made its way down to the LA area. Now let's quickly go over everything that you would need to roll up your joint. First, you're gonna need your cannabis. Only gonna use roughly a gram, maybe Maybe a gram and a half of cannabis. Also going to obviously need a joint rolling paper. Highly recommend raw papers. They're one of the easiest rolling paper brands to find in smoke shops and they've always been consistently high quality. I would also highly recommend that you pick up a grinder uh, for rolling joints just because it's way easier to get a good looking joint. The last thing I would really recommend to have is a tip or a crutch. You take a piece of paper and you roll it over until it forms cylinder shape, something that won't completely collapse on itself. If you're lucky enough in your smoke shop to find an actual box of pre-made tips, like little raw tips like this, it really just saves you a lot of hassle. So now that I have everything ready and set up to roll my joint, let's get into the fun. Let's dive in. First up, let us grind up this cannabis and see how nice and clean it is. Pop in these nugs of cannabis. People like to break up the nugs before you put it into the grinder. I think it totally depends on how good of a grinder you have. Now that I have it ground up, filled with cannabis, let's just go ahead and put it out on this rolling tray since we have it. You can just kind of shape out what you think size joint that you're looking to roll. I'm going to be using the king size papers. At the very top of the sheet, there's a little like extra shiny area. That's the glue that when you wet it, when you lick it, this is the seal that will close over and keep your joint together. Crutch ready and I put that down first. Helps create a little canoe for your joint, just like this. And that's what you're gonna, that's how you're gonna start filling your cannabis. It's all just kind of lined up. Start shaping the cannabis, rolling it over and using your thumbs to pat it down. Now you'll see like my crutch fell out, that's totally fine. You can put it back in. Basically just taking it almost like a little like taco style and just rolling it. And then see, so you'll get these little extra crumblies. If you start seeing like little extra coming out the end, it's totally fine. You can always repack it at the end. This is, I would say the trickiest part. Instead of lining it up totally center and trying to roll it like this, you're going to take the crutch end and you're going to roll it down like this. It's going to make it so that it's actually going to get bigger as you go closer to the lit end. And that's what's going to give it that cone shape. Take it and this is where you tuck it in. Tuck it in. Tuck and roll and just work your way up. You know, just, just a little bit of the edge paper kind of left out. You pretty much have wrapped over enough to close off the joint. And you're going to lick it. And nice and moist and then roll it over. Give it a couple little like pat downs. Just gonna slowly pack it down. This is also why having a crutch is so nice. Poke it down, give it some flicks, shifting all of the cannabis down. You can twist it off, you could burn it off. I'm just going to twist this off, burn that little excess, and voila, you now have your finished joint. I'm really happy that it has kept a cone shape so that it's not just a skinnier pencil, but it actually does have kind of a bat shape. The last step is just to make sure that it smokes. Cheers, everyone. Okay, definitely hits. I'm getting a lot of the peach punch and less of the paper, which is so nice. But thank you so much, everyone, for joining me on this 420 tutorial. If you're new to the channel, I would love if you would subscribe to this cannabis community or if you'd just like to watch more videos from us right now, either of the thumbnails off to the left. Thank you so much for watching. Sending goodbyes.